Honestly, I thought it was a super dope City Edition jersey just because of the inspiration and backstory to this jersey. So if you're from the area, they have a neighborhood called Bronzeville, which is socially and economically diverse. And just using that as a staple in this jersey, I thought was like, man, that's genius that really encompasses City Edition jersey. Besides the blue colorway, they've used it for like the Great Lakes. The side panel on these jerseys, they have a mural down in Bronzeville called the Patchwork. And so they use inspiration from that to run down the side panel. And I was like, man, that next level thinking. Today we got in hand and uh, let's bust it out, check out the details and see what it looks like in person. Can't believe I held this for almost five months. All right, so starting off at the collar, you can see cream colorway. Then you got the beautiful championship patch. Number two, stitched down. Beautiful arm opening is blue. Then you got your prototypical Jerry West, heat pressed. And then you got Antetokounmpo. Single stitched, super long last name. I'm always surprised how it fits. And then you got the numbering. So you can see here, single stitched, you can see where it's ventilated on the twill, right down there. Four, pretty much the same style as well. And then bottom right hand corner, dry fit advanced. But when we look at the side panel, you see a polyester piece right there that's cream. And then when we look at this, you got all the colorways that the Bucks used to wear, blue with the legs cream. You got some light green to dark green, and it's supposed to be inspired by the patchwork mural, and you have it on the opposite side as well. And that is the back of the jersey. All right, so on the front side, you got a V-neck collar, some reinforced stitching down the middle. Same thing as the back, but Nike swoosh cream and that is single stitch down beautiful then you got milwaukee across the chest so you got cream single stitched that is a pretty long across the chest kind of like the last name then you got 34 which is pretty much like the backside, just a little smaller number and then on the side panel you could see here more of it on both sides then we go to gathering place so that's where all the lakes meet. It's orange and this is heat pressed onto the jersey. Then you got your jock tag, city edition, plus two length, authentic run. See some little side split action. And that right there is the front of the jersey. And this is what it looks like when you wear the jersey. Totally forgot I bought the blue hat when I bought the jersey. Like I was trying to look for it and I was like, where the hell did I put it? But man, Looks dope, I'm biased, I like the color blue. Look at that, Milwaukee across the chest, the patchwork mural inspiration with the like different books colorways. Super clean, got it on both sides. You got Giannis on the back. One, two, three, four, five. Ah, it takes forever. And that's the jersey. As much as I hate to say it, when I take a step back and just judge it just for a city edition solely, kind of on the planer side they didn't do anything like out the ordinary they kind of recycled old stuff like the gathering place thing um the colorway kind of similar to the old blue colorway just you know just one solid color this time around so if i gotta give it a rate ah it hurts me i gotta give it a three gotta give it a three three out of five with that being said what do you guys think about the jersey let me know in the comments below and hey Thanks again for watching guys and on to the next video. I mean, it's still clean, but man, maybe I should have got the shorts.